I'm going to discuss the medial knee and our medial collateral ligament. So our medial collateral ligament runs from our medial femoral condyle down to our proximal tibia. So to get that we go in our coronal plane onto the edge of the knee joint, find our knee joint and as we scan towards the bed and away we will see our ligament. So here it is here, we come up and we want to assess our origin, this is where uh, quite a few of our strains will occur. So we're just going to pan through there, it's quite a broad attachment so we want to focus all the way across, cover that as we come down and where we cross the knee joint, this is where we have our deep uh, medial collateral ligament here and our meniscus sitting just in under. As we continue down we can see our ligament continue down over our tibia and inserting onto our proximal tibia there. Over the top we have three tendons. This is our sartorius, our gracilis and our semi-tendinosis. Semi-tendinous. So this is our three ligaments of our pes anserine. So uh, we have a nice way of trying to remember those. Sip, gin and tonic. Uh, a sartorius, gracilis, semitendinosis. So this is uh, an area where if we see changes here, it's usually uh, due to a secondary cause, so an underlying tubule stress fracture, rheumatological condition. Uh, sometimes if there's injury to our medial meniscus, we may have some fluid tracking down into this region. You can see just deep to the ligament here is our inframedial genicular artery and neurovascular bundle just pulsing away there. So that is our medial knee.